Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name's David and this is the 13 decks of Halloween. <laughs> That's right, we're going to do 13 days, 13 deck reviews of the spookiest decks in my collection. Actually, there's plenty of decks in my collection that would qualify as a spooky or Halloween-themed uh, deck. Uh, but these are just 13 that I grabbed, uh, kind of at random, kind of not, uh, that we're going to show to you for the next 13 days. So, get ready. Here we go. Coming in at number 13, we've got the Steampunk Bandits from Gambler's Warehouse and PlayingCards.net. Uh, this was a Kickstarter. Kickstarter from Gambler's Warehouse. If you want to learn more, you can visit gamblerswarehouse.com. Uh, they're themed out in Dallas, Texas. Uh, this deck is kind of uh, 1800s meets uh, a war-torn United States, and they are printed from the United States Playing Card Company. Uh, one of the reasons why I picked it, uh, it's just really uh, cool that they've kind of married these two ideas of steampunk and uh, skulls together, because really, it's kind of a skull robotics type deck. Um, you get a double backer in there, you get a double face gaff, all original jokers, it's all black on black, black edges, and you got the uh, juxtaposition of the clock wheels and the steampunk-esque ness, and it just makes for a really cool deck to include in these 13 decks of Halloween. So that is it for this quick review. Uh, if you want to learn more, you can click the link below in the description that'll include our original review. Tune in tomorrow when we're going to look at the skull deck from Gambler's Warehouse and PlayingCards.net. Thanks, bye.